Hello dear viewers, this is day 25 of our English speaking course and today we'll be learning about the uh, voices, active voice and passive voice. So, uh, he sings a song, wa geet gata hai. Tam log isse kya change kar sakte? A song is sung by him. I delivered the message. The message was delivered. They will play cricket. Cricket will be played by them. Are you writing a letter? Is a letter being written by you? Laborers were digging a canal. A canal was being dug by the laborers. Have you finished this job? Has this job been finished by you? Okay. Uh, passive voice the Taj was built at an enormous cost maze is shown in the rainy season ok do this walk let this walk be done ask him to sit down let him be asked to sit down punish him let him be punished by you advertise the post let the post be advertised Please don't smoke. You are requested not to smoke. Don't encourage indiscipline. Indiscipline should not be encouraged. This way we change the passive voice. And this is very important. In the professional world, it is used uh, uh, to uh, get rid of, uh, you can say, uh, basically it is used in paraphrasing when you are uh, paraphrasing some of the articles or writings so you can use the active and passive voice so that's all for the day 25 and we will be learning uh, on day 26 that's all